The week beginning the 4th of October internationally marks World Space Week. Winchester plays host to the UK's largest capacity planetarium, which chose to celebrate World Space Week locally. People of all ages attended the events over the weekend and were able to take part in an array of activities. Children were encouraged to be as interactive as possible in order to get a personal understanding of space science, potentially nurturing our budding scientists of the future. Special guests Akiva were at the event demonstrating how to beam people up into space and back down to Earth using TV signals and their satellite resources. Airbus Defence and Space Engineer apprentices were also there showing off their latest rocket projects. Families could craft together their own rockets and test them in the centre's grounds. So here, all week we've had activities for schools, so now at the weekend it's opened up to the public. So we have space engineers, we have satellite engineers, we have experts on moon rocks, we have people who know all about observational astronomy, amateur astronomers. We have people making star maps, doing all different types of activities with the public and all for the price of a normal visit. So we love space here and we do live planetarium shows regularly and all sorts of film shows and we have all different activities. But it's fantastic just to get everything together and get a really festive atmosphere with people launching rockets everywhere and the Star Wars guys walking around. It's my favourite week of the year. No Space Weekend event would be complete without appearances from the Rebel Legion and other Star Wars characters led by Darth Vader himself. This has been Amy Best for Winchester News Online and may the force be with you.